Hey everybody, it's me over Jones back with a new video. <laughs> the second presidential debate. Uh, I uh, hung out with my buddy William. Uh, we watched it over his place. Uh, and I gotta say, I can't believe I'm saying this, but CNN, <laughs> CNN was actually actually did an excellent job when it comes to moderating a debate. And, and I heard people say that you know ABC was was very was very liberal, very left leaning, and I didn't know at the time. I, I didn't really know how bad it was at ABC. You know, because as far as as far as leftism goes, uh, MSNBC is like well, that's what I thought was I thought where where it was, but ABC <laughs> ABC is a different monster. Um, I would say that you know at the end of the debate, I was telling my buddy I think it was more of a draw. You know, it wasn't it wasn't the same. It wasn't like the same. It didn't have the same feeling as when you when you watch the first debate between. Uh, Trump and Biden, but uh, but I'd say that Trump did hold his own, and he kind of had to because, and, and a lot of people are saying right now it was like a three on one, it was like Trump versus Harris and the moderators, because he was being fact checked by the moderate by the moderators, you know, countless times while they're letting Harris get away with saying things that should have been fact checked, and she and there's like the same same old things so the. Good people on both sides. That lie. Um, what was one? I try to think of uh, one of the ones she she, she brought up. Um, the mess that went on during January six. Uh, about you know, I was like like he didn't like he didn't act like, and it was and it was, and it was actually not, no that actually that one was against the moderators because Trump had Trump had to remind him no he told he he said he said peaceful and patriotic. And what, they, and what they did, and what they, and what they, you know, failed to mention, was that Twitter actually deleted, actually shut. They, they, I think they shut, they, they shut down his account during that during that day. And also, he and, he, and Trump brought up correct. He correctly brought up that um, that the, that Nancy Pelosi was in charge of basically the National Guard when it came to when it came to matters of the Capitol. It was on her, and it was actually on. It was actually filmed by Pelosi's daughter. That she was responsible for the, for the National Guard not being out there to offer offer greater security to keep to keep things in order. Um, and I guess Trump got his, you know, and I think I see, you, can, you can see Trump. He got he, you know he got frustrated. He was getting frustrated, but he stayed on message. I will say that he stayed on message. He stayed hammering home hammering home the point that it, why is Kamala saying that she's going to do all these things when she's when she becomes you know when she becomes president when. With the current position that she's in right now, it, these things could have been done. You know, the border could have been shut, could have been shut down. All these issues that were, all these issues that we're facing currently, could have been taken care of three and a half years ago. But she, but she was, but she, but she was nowhere to be seen. Biden was a vegetable. <laughs> the mo most, do a mo most of the time, you know, most of the time in that position. And he just kept hammering home that point. He kept, and now they, and they, they say he was a liar. We talked about the. About the Haitian, that the Haitian migrants, you know, uh, slaughtering and eating eating people's pets. It turns out that that tends to be the, that seems to be the case. There have been uh, people reported um, Haitian migrants in Ohio. First of all, why Ohio? Why, why were they brought to Ohio? Why twenty thousand in Ohio? Is is beyond me. But they were slaughtering geese and ducks. Some people said, you know, they they, they actually called a lady eating someone's cat. I had a, had a cat's head chopped off, and this lady was eating the cat. <laughs> Haitian was essentially eating a cat. Someone, someone reported that they had a cat uh, hung up in a tree as if it was being dressed like, like it was a deer. Uh, you know, um, but you know, I, I guess I guess there were things that Trump could have done better. I, you know, I, th I I suppose, but really, like I said, he was uh, it was like it was it was one it was one versus three. You know, he had. He had, but I will say he did hold his own, and he did throw back in Kamala what she thought she was going to use the whole like, she, like, which, like, like what she did to, what she did to Mike Pence. You know, Pence is a pushover anyway, but Trump did it to her twice. <laughs> so excuse me, I'm talking, and he said, "This sounds familiar." <laughs> so I, I got to come in for that. But um, yeah, but now there's now there's uh, some talk about uh, Kamala wants to do another debate, which I don't think that's saying that she had. I don't think that's saying she had a good debate last night. I think that's I think that's her team trying to say that you know what she could do, she could do better, um, 
which is which is interesting because she was only willing to she seemed like she was only willing to do one debate, but Trump said he'll do you know four or five before the election, you know. So so it's, it's pretty wild to see how you know it's pretty wild to see how this thing is turning out, but um. I'm, I still think I still think you know I'm not sure if it really moved the needle when it comes to independence. I would say that at least they're more informed. Um, people who are going to vote for Trump are going to vote for Trump. People who are going to vote for Harris are going to vote for Harris. But I will say this: at least people who are voting for Trump can just can actually justify it and actually use tangible evidence as to why they why they support him. I can use tangible evidence as to why I support him. I think he he, he did he was excellent with our he did a great job with our economy. I can't imagine how bad things would have gotten in 2020 had he not been behind the helm. You know, and I think it was I think it was commendable when he let the states handle handle the handle their own uh, handle their own situations in terms of quarantines, lockdowns, stuff like that, instead of locking down the entire nation. You know, uh, Harris is an empty suit. You know, she I think and I, it's crazy thing. I think she she'd be worse than Biden. Um. Because Biden, even though Biden has, you know, Biden has fallen apart, you know, cognit cognitively, cognitively, she is just, she's just not there at all. Um, and she has, and she has, and there's a record to prove it. There's a record to prove. There's a record to prove her incompetence. I think. I think if, if Trump does, if Trump does. A, does, does a second debate with Harris? He needs to hammer home more on her record of incompetence, not just on the border, but just how how was she how was she as a um, how was she as a as a DA? I think one of the things he could have brought up was how you know how when he see when she got on Trump as to you know him about him being you know not bringing I guess being decent or um, being for the people. He could have you know he could have brought up how was it was, were you for the people when you locked people up beyond their beyond their uh, the sentencing time. Were you for the people when you when you when you try to squeeze free labor out of out of prisoners? Were you for the people when you when you try to get it? You try to keep a guy on death row when there's evidence when there's evidence proving that he was innocent. Things like that. I think there there's plenty of ammunition that can be used against her. Um, but it all comes down to him, but you know how how he's being coached. You know what is you know what kind of information his team is giving him that can be used as ammunition. Um, she doesn't have any policies. She can't talk about it. And I think it's, and I think it's good when Trump, when they, when, when the when the moderator asks Trump, when he, you know, how would he, how do you do, how would he, how would he do the deportations? I'm actually glad he kept it. I'm actually glad he kept that secret. He doesn't have to talk about. He doesn't have to go into detail as to. First of all, he couldn't go into detail in two. He can't go into good detail in two minutes. Second, she has no policies. So I think it'd be a good idea not to give her any ideas as to. What what she sh what she should be doing in the in the position that, she, as, that she's in right now? If she can't handle the job right now in her current position, how is she going to handle it with, with even greater responsibility as as uh, as head of state, as commander in chief? And I, and I will say he did a good job in bringing up how she screwed up the negotiation between Russia and Ukraine. <laughs> I can actually I do I remember that. I remember it was um, you know she talked about how she was there to try to keep a war from happening. And a few days later, war ha war happened. Um, also, the you know hammering home uh, the screw up that was Afghanistan. So I say Trump did a good job. There are a few more things. There are, there's a lot more ammunition he can work with if he does if he does a second debate. But um, but I say an advantage he has. He's not afraid. He's not him and JD Vance. They don't duck me smoke. They ain't afraid of talking to anybody. They'll go, they'll go to anybody. They, they'll go to anyone to, to, um, to be interviewed. And I gotta commend that. Harris, <laughs> Waltz, this you know, MIA. Like, you know, like, where, 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 where are they? They won't talk to the press. They, even, the, even the press, that, even, the, even, the, even, the, even the mainstream media that was supposed to, that was supposed to heavily be on their side, they refused to talk to them. Even that last interview that she did, um, with, I think it's Dana Bash. And, you know, it's, and, it, and it sounded like she was actually looking at, people were saying that she's looking down the whole time, like she was looking at, she's looking at notes. Which I, which I can believe, because she, do, she doesn't do very well, uh, you know, off script. But yeah, those are my thoughts. Share um, tell me what you guys think. Think Trump did a good job. Think Harris did a good job. Uh, you know, please leave a comment in the comment section. Like, share, and subscribe. Uh, if you want to help out the channel, go to my whole page on YouTube. Look for the PayPal link and the Cash App link. All donation amounts are appreciated. Any gripes, complaints, see what I can, send me a send me a PM. I'll see what I can do to address them. Uh, but that's my video. It's the second presidential debate. I'm Edward Jones. You guys take care. Be safe. Stay strapped. And God bless.